Hey guys, welcome to Animal Corner. My name is Jamie and today we are discussing the Hakari Fiber Bites and the Algae Wafers. Stay tuned. <laughs> Okay guys, we are uh, discussing Hakari today, that's uh, a brand of fish food, um, it, a lot, it's a lot of use in America, it's produced in Japan, so it's, it's very uh, exotic food. Um, I will first talk about the algae wafers, some of the ingredients are fish meal, dried seaweed, uh, alfalfa, that's a type of grass, uh, what more? fish oil, krill meal, spirulina, and garlic. So let's open the packet and uh, let's see what is, what is inside. I just caught it, the first time that I will try it. Ooh, very nice size. I don't know if you can see that. It's a thumbnail big. Better. Smells pretty good. All right. It's it's packed in in bags. I don't know if that is is uh, a thing that I will do. Um, the positive thing on this is with the zip, zip uh, closure, zipper, yeah, press zipper. So it will stay relatively fresh. I'm curious how the fish will like it. We will see. Now we are opening the Vibra Bites from Hakari. On the package, it stay the it says that it will uh, prevent. Uh, diseases. Um, it will offer ex an excellent growth and form of your fish. What more? Very slow sinking, a unique worm like stick. Let's see. Ooh. They are tiny. Maybe I saw I'm, uh, I want them a little bit bigger. It's a little bit bloodworm structure and, and, and size, size, that's worth. The thing with Akari fiber bites and algae wafers is you buy uh, uh, you buy a, a little packet, but the packet is full. Not ships, you open it and it's half full. No, this is really full. The ingredients of the Hakari Fiber Bites are uh, fish meal, krill meal, fish oil, crushed silkworms, even mealworms is in it, and also garlic. I like garlic in the food of my fishes. Uh, what's more? Calcium and magnesium. Sounds okay for me. Let's see what fish like it. Okay, guys, this is my aquarium. It's a 55 gallon uh, aquarium of jewel. Let's see what fish that I have. I have some uh, angelfish, dantum angelfish. It's a, it's a, it's a cross or a wild caught and uh, and uh, domesticated angelfish. I have some festivums. Here is the other one, here is, it's a couple, I already have eggs from them, some German blue rams, also a couple, some baby Hecali cichlids, now baby, this is around inch and a half, and some Rio schooling fish. The total view.
Let's do a Soma Aureum. Some Auto Cats. Some Black Venezuela Curries. Back to the topic of the day. We will try the Hakari. First, the algae wafers. Let's grab some. One here. One over here. Now the Fabra Bites. I already say they are really small. So don't buy them for big fish. It's slow sinking. The fish are eating it. They are not spitting it out. So that's good. Also the nice thing on Vibrabytes, they are red colored, so when you have a light substrate or a dark substrate, they will all, always see it on the bottom. Give them some more. So as you can see, even the black Venezuela curry is lighting the Vibrabytes. There is an algae wafer. Not touched, not, not yet. Okay guys, that was it for the video. Uh, I can tell you the LG wafer will be eaten, but I have a very shy Sterosaur Aram. Um, I hope that you liked the video. Please do me a favor, hit the subscribe button, put on the notification bell so you don't miss a video of mine. See you later, and as always, keep it animal.